First, what type of home ownership do you have? Are you a homeowner or a renter? I'm a homeowner. Homeowner. And what type of structure? Is it a single family detached or a multi-unit apartment, condo, a duplex? It's a single. Single. And what's the approximate move-in date? The approximate what? Move-in date? Like when did oh, you all start uh, living in your home? It was nineteen August 1997. Okay, August 1997. So have you always lived here in Cook County? No, I, I've lived in uh, a good part of my life in Berrien County. Berrien County, okay. So how did you how did you and your family end up here? Well, my wife is from Cook County, and mm -hmm. we uh, I was came here because she was grew up here, and and we just moved here. Okay. Um, I actually am from the Philippines, and I moved here in 2015 for school at UGA. And then my husband's from Tifton, so we are now living there. But unlike you, I am actually a renter. We are renting to own, mm -hmm. but same thing, it's single family detached. So can you describe further what kind of home you live in, the type of roof, how much floors, like two-story, one-story, number of bedrooms, and all that? It is three bedrooms. Mm -hmm. I have, uh, it is a... Uh wood but it has vinyl on the outside mm -hmm. and it has a metal roof metal roof okay and have you ever adopted or invested in solar energy it could be on your roof or any type of facility in your business have you ever adopted solar energy i have not you have not and may i ask why not i just I just had, and I've, I've saw, saw some solar panels and stuff like that, but I've never, never really never, done it. Never really researched it or anything. Okay. Um, you said you have a metal roof, correct? That's correct. Was that decision made for you, or did you decide on that yourself? Uh, my my home was, uh, it was completely remodeled in 95, 96, mm -hmm. and, but the roof was not changed, and I was in need of another roof. And my wife works for a guy that has a, here in Cook County, mm -hmm. that has a... Uh, roofing company? Roofing. It's actually elite structures here in Cook mm -hmm. County. And I got metal from him. It's commercial grade metal, and I just went with that. To mm -hmm. the, and I, But I do have a skylight on my... Though that's, I know that's not solar, but I do have a skylight in my kitchen. Okay. I, I kept that when I... I'm not familiar with skylight. What What is that? It's a... Uh, it's a, like a... It's a... It, before it was like a plastic, kind of mm -hmm. like a bubble that let slide in. Mm -hmm. And when the sun comes up and the daylight and everything, you it, it gives off enough light that you don't really have to turn the lights on. Okay. But the one that I have on now, when they re redid the metal, they put the metal on it's glass. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if ever solar power, solar energy is made available, do you think you would adopt it? Possibly, I would. I would probably think about it anyway. Mm -hmm. And w what makes you say possibly? Uh, I would. I would check the benefits and see if it would save me energy and mm -hmm. you know, maybe cut cut down on my electricity. I live in the city of Adel, and sometimes it seems like the uh, utilities can be expensive, mm -hmm. especially during the summer months. Okay. So now you have the map of the United States of America in front of you with your pin. Can you circle in there or put a mark where you think the highest adopters of solar energy, where do you think they live? I would I would say out west. I mean, okay. That's what I would think. Uh, I would say it's over here. That's what, mm -hmm. what I would think. Um, why do you think they're over there? Um... Uh, I just, I just think maybe here we're slow to, slow to adopt and change things okay. and all. Maybe, maybe they're ahead there. Mm -hmm. What about the people who live there? What do you think the kind of people who might be adopting solar energy? What kind of jobs do they have? Do you have lower income or higher income? What kind of people are they? I think they have higher income. Higher income people. Yeah. It would probably adopt the it. cost of living I think would be higher there also okay so do you think people who live in the West and who might have higher income 
are they any different or similar to your community here in Cook County? Uh, they're, it's different. Different? There. Okay. And now I have the same question, only this time you'll be looking at the map of the state of Georgia. Uh -huh. So if you can put a mark there, where do you think the highest adapters of solar energy, where do you think they live? I would say uh, around the Atlanta area. Okay. That's what I would say. That's what I would say. And why, do you, why would you guess around the Atlanta area? What makes those people over there most likely highly to adopt? Solar energy. They they have more higher income. And mm -hmm. the, that's what I would say. Okay. And do you think people from Atlanta are any similar or different from people from Cook County? They're similar in some ways and they're different in others. They mm -hmm. just, they may have access to better things than we have here. And All right. And what about people in your life, like in your inner circle, your friends, your family that live in the state of Georgia? Do you know anybody who is using, currently using rooftop solar energy? I do not. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of just people that you know, um, what do you call this? Like not close friends, but acquaintances. Do you know anybody that uses solar energy? I don't know anybody. You don't know anybody. All right. So with that, one final question. Um, on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being very knowledgeable in terms of rooftop solar, 1 not so knowledgeable, how would you rank yourself? I would say 1. A 1? Okay. Yeah. Not enough knowledge about it. What about Cook County in general? Uh, 1. 1, okay. Thank you, sir. And that concludes our interview.